The NBA, the NBA has two games points to get to Thursday afternoon basketball. Joined by Craig Anthony, Steve Smith, and David Aldridge. This is Kevin Harden. So it belongs to the bench. Here's the five for Quinn Snyder right now. Weber is out there with Drexler. Then it's Joel Embiid. Then there's Russell Westbrook. And it's Jordan in at the two spot. And for the Celtics, we've got Sean Kemp. Kyle Korver is out there with Jason Kidd. Then it's Bam Adebayo. And it's Tatum in at the small forward. So the tip off, it's Miami. Westbrook with it. The three ball. Rebound, Boston. Now Adebayo. Looking for Corver, he gets it there. Pass to Kidd. Shot clock at six. Campus screen on Drexler. Away team foul. Michael Jordan. That's his first personal foul. First team foul. Kemp kicks to kid. It's blocked. Drexler against Kemp. Pass to MB. Here's Westbrook. Good ball movement here by Miami. And the three ball is good. Westbrook. Realizing this guy has the green light to take those shots. Westbrook has such confidence in that jump. Tatum deciding where to go with it. Over Drexler. And it's off the back rim. No good. And here's Miami. And you think back to that 2017 draft. Scouts trying to poke holes in Tatum's game. But really, Why? he just Drexler. needed a little time to develop his skills and get stronger. Yeah, going hard to the rack, making a statement here early on. Well, this is his game. Be proactive offensively. Put the defense back on his heels. Outside Tatum. Out of bounds. Miami takes possession. A team ball. So first quarter just over a minute and a half in. Near the three-point line, it's Westbrook. That one a tad offline to the right, but drops in for him. And without naming names, it feels like Tatum, you know, is starting to dominate other all-stars at his position. And now his game is so complete. Regularly over 40% from three. He can drive and post you up. The only success defenders have is when they guess right. Passes it to Drexler. A chance there to push it to double digits, but it's off the mark. And even three on three break. Oh, a nice defensive play to disrupt the alley oop. Weber, the pass to Drexler. That one misses. Now the Celtics take it the other way. Westbrook against Kidd. Outside Tatum. Adebayo with a screen on Westbrook. Here's Kidd. And he can't stop the run as he misses. Four shots, four misses. And you can sense a certain frustration building. And here's Westbrook from the arc. Drexler against Tatum. Drexler kicks to Embiid. Five on the clock and stolen by Tatum. Corver passes to Adebayo and Adebayo throws it down. The gravity of Kyle Corver drawing defenders away from finding the open man. for the Celtics. Yeah. 
Miami leading by five. There's Floyd. He kicks to Abdul Jabbar. There's the pass to Malone. Plays it up off the glass. Malone. And Malone's strip can be intimidating. He's superb at scoring, even when the D is draped all over. Just over three and a half minutes gone here in the first. Pass to George. Unloads from 13, and the jumper is on the mark. Proving how dangerous he is. Give George these looks, and he'll knock him down. Pass to Bryant. Here's Floyd, covered by Mitchell. Malone outside. And here's Kobe from the arc. Good on the three-point shot. And it just seems that every pass they make is leading to a score. Just great ball movement. Boston trails by eight. Away team foul. Leaky Floyd. That's his first personal foul. Second team foul. It's stolen by Abdul Jabbar. And they've got to get their heads into this game. They're giving the ball away far too easy. Can't fault the play call. Even though he could convert, that's a good shot. Now, here is George. He feeds it to McHale. Chandler with the screen on Bryant. Herder passes to Chandler. It doesn't go for him. Nice defense from Malone. And here's Miami. They're on a 12 to 4 run. And Bryant kicks to Baylor. Kobe dishes to Abdul Jabbar. Back to Bryant from past the arc. And again, Miami Kobe with the triple. Bryant. And what a way to start this game, dominating at both ends of the floor. They came in prepared, the end of the focused, quarter, and really the jumped on the other the team, team early. Four. And so it's Miami holding on to an 11-point cushion as we get ready to take a break. They're shooting the ball so well in this one. A great performance from the field. And we'll be right back after this. This, folks, second quarter of basketball. This game has not exactly been neck and neck, but plenty of time left in this one. And guys, let's get your take on the scoring breakdown so far for Miami. They didn't need any time to warm up from long range today. Their three-point shooting has been terrific in the first half. And the other thing, though, is their execution in terms of their ball movement has been flawless. Sets up a lot of easy scoring opportunities. In a moment now to reset the lineups, courtesy of Gatorade, all fueled up for the second quarter of basketball. On the floor for Miami, Baylor is out there with Weber, then it's Jordan, then it's Joel Embiid, and it's Floyd in at the point. Some guys just understand how to generate points. He's one of them. Baylor kicks to Embiid. Got a piece of it. Here's Weber. Good for the basket. Great Starting player. off one for one with that shot. Another good play. This is how they built the lead. Calling on the right guy at the right time. The reason why they stayed aggressive and they have not let up this entire night. And at this point, I wouldn't expect them to. Now here's Tatum. And out of bio. Throws it down. Out of Wonderful play. With that long wingspan and huge hands, Otto Bio catches and finishes with ease. Miami leading by nine. Here in the second quarter with a little over a minute gone. Baylor drives in. Kicks it to Jordan. Six on the shot clock. Set it up with the fake, but it's offline. 
and so Adebayo will bring it up for the Celtics. Yes, that goes in. John, that was big because they dug a big hole in the first quarter, but starting to show signs of life. And now approaching two minutes of action here in the second quarter. Floyd passes to Jordan. That one's in his first Michael bucket of the game. Jordan. He's one for two. The yeah, high percentage look for Jordan. It has every move you could ask for in the painted area. Boston trails by nine. Now here's Kidd. Still looking for his first bucket in this one. It's tipped. Elgin Baylor on the wing. Guarded by Tatum. Baylor passes the four. Jacks up a three. And again, Miami with the triple. Baylor. He got a clean look, and he makes the defense pay for disrespecting him. Now here's Kidd. He's guarding closely. All this means is he has to be careful. Don't want to pick up a cheapie and get sent to the bench for three fouls. So both teams making some changes here. for the team. Here in the second quarter, we've played a little over two and a half minutes now. Bible, the pass to court. Lock at six. Passes it to Kidd. Beyond the arc. And it's Miami with the rebound. Westbrook scanning the floor. Bay pulls it in. Boston trails by 12. Adebayo with the ball. Westbrook picks him up. Feibel finds Adebayo. Three-pointer. Kidd trains it from beyond the arc. Kidd's got himself on the board with three there. And in the second quarter, a little under three and a half minutes played already. And here's Westbrook. Five points in the game. Kid with the steal. And pushing it up. Here's Boston. There's Bay. Porter gets a wide open look. And again, Boston with the triple. That's Kyle's bread and butter. He's a big time outside threat. Title. Away team. Boston making some changes. Kevin McHale, who checked in for Bam Adebayo. Paul George comes in for Sadiq Bay. And it's Mitchell in for Jason Kidd. And then for Miami, Abdul Jabbar's checked in for Joel Embiid. Malone comes in for Weber. And Kobe is subbed in for Jordan. Drexler kicks to Malone. Miami no good on that time either. Boston trails by six. A shot by George, wide open. And again, Boston with the triple. He doesn't need much time to get his shot off. Paul George is a dependable catch and shoot option. The nine-foot shot picks it out to Malone. Ryan in the post, defended by Feibel. Drexler gets the bucket. Not just a knockdown shooter, he does a great job of finding space for his shot. George passes to Feibel. It's George on the wing. Five points in the game. And they had some botched coverage that turned into no cover. Eight second difference between the shot clock and the game clock. One on one here. Got a piece of it. Got to run the clock and wait for the last shot. Yes, you do, but it's a dilemma. If you get a great look earlier in the clock, do you take it? We have got to see that sensational one one block again. And guys, that is lockdown defense at its finest. Going right at the shot and then able to knock it away. 11 seconds left in the first half of basketball. They grab their own miss. Malone dishes to Abdul-Jabbar. From deep three-point range, he doesn't hit that one. 
And so it's Miami with their lead standing at 6.0 at the end of the quarter. A good size advantage, and they'll look to increase it. And don't go away. We'll be right back. one plenty of basketball left in a game that's been fairly even so far Kobe Bryant really making a difference here. Yeah, there is no stopping him and you can't even contain him at this point he is that talented yeah and sometimes the strategy in that case don't let anyone else beat you you know he's going to get his so try and keep it to that so with McHale sitting on the bench Here's the five for Jason Kidd right now. They've got out of bite. Jason Tatum is out there with Sean Kemp. Then there's Kyle Quirk. And it's Kidd in at the one. Kidd against Westbrook. How the pass to Embiid. Weber kicks to Drexler. It's Jordan on the wing. Six to shoot. Drexler, no good. And there's the call on Joel Embiid. That's his first foul. His first personal foul. First team foul. And here's Tatum. He'll bring it up for Boston. It's a three-point game. Yeah, clearly he had established a position there. That's his first personal foul. Second team foul. Tatum on the wing. Adebayo with a screen for Tatum. That misses and a chance to tie it there. Miami leading by three. Here's Drexel. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. Miami shooting their first free throw. First trip to the line in this one. First one falls for him. Shooting for both shots. Good from the strike money from the strike. He does a great job night in and night out. Outside Tatum. A three. Headshot off. And it's Miami the other way. They've held a 12-point lead earlier. Puts it up from 12. Weber. And the layup's good off the glass. Weber. And Miami leads by seven. Terrific play call to give him a clean look at the rim. That's how you want to start the second half. Listen, put the ball in the hands of your best scorers and let them go to work. Keep it simple. Here's Tatum after Chris Weber's score. Here's Kidd. Good. And it's Tatum picking up the assist. Kidd's got five. Unselfish play by Tatum. Getting it to a shooter in rhythm instead of chasing his own shot. Or three. Westbrook rebound by the Celtics. Okay, that's frustrating. You work hard to get these open looks. You know he liked that one back. There's the double team with Westbrook. Oh, and the foul called on Russell Westbrook. That is his first foul of the game. And still early in the period. And they're only one foul away from being over the limit. Boston may get a switch here. Windler's checked in. Tatum against Baylor. Adebayo, and that basket is going to count. Goaltending in the official call. The confidence continues to grow off the board. Adebayo takes it right back up. Tyson Chandler is checked in for Bam Adebayo. Here's Foy. He's covered by Kidd. Pass to Baylor. Here's Embiid. Jordan, the pass to Weber target from three-point range. Boston trails by three. Pass to Kidd. Outside Tatum. Oh, 
And Joel Embiid pulls it down. No doubt it's been a bit of a struggle for him here in this quarter in terms of scoring. Here's Baylor. It's deflected. Very cold start to the second half. One for five. Looking for some continuity. This is it to Chandler. Tatum, that's for two. Good in the assist to Kidd. The quick thinking of Tatum. You, you have to be impressed with how he readies himself to shoot before he gets the ball. A different look for Miami. Abdul Jabbar has checked in for Joel Embiid. Malone comes in for Weber. And it's Bryant in for Jordan. One forty nine left in the third. Here's Floyd covered by Mitchell and the basket by Malone. To stretch out the defense. You just need enough guys on the floor who can make that shot. Mitchell with it. He's been quiet so far. Still no points in the game. Banked in off the glass. Well we've seen that movie a few times haven't we. An easy bucket in the paint. Now Kobe, he's got six. He kicks to Abdul-Jabbar. Good ball movement here by Miami. Shot clock at six, and it's sent back by McKay. They get it back, and the basket by Malone. 59 seconds left to play in the third. Herder passes to Mitchell. He's looking for McHale and finds him. Misses off the left eye. Miami leading by four. Baylor kicks to Abdul-Jabbar for three. Kobe, offensive rebound, controls the rebound and puts it back up and in. Just in a perfect position to grab that rebound and then get the putback. Mitchell right side. About seven seconds separating the shot and game clocks. Kobe dishes to Malone. And the pass to four. Now, here is Abdul Jabbar for three. Kobe, the rebound by Paul George. His struggles from the field continue, yet they still hold the lead. That's his third personal foul, fourth team foul. Substitution here's Mitchell. For the away team. There's a screen by McHale. Pass to George. Over Malone. No good with the wing jumper. No one on him. He committed to fading away. Probably could have taken more time with that shot. And so it's Miami with a six-point lead at the end of the quarter. The defensive work they've done against Paul George has been a big factor. He hasn't done anywhere near the kind of damage we expected. And we've got more NBA action on 2K. And now let's go back to a play from earlier as we show you our State Farm assist of the game. And, you know, you can always count on him for at least a couple of these pretty assists over the course of a game. And this one, a thing of beauty. You see why they trust him with the ball in his hands. He can make the simple play, and he can pull off the spectacular. Come on, fans. We've reached the fourth quarter, quarter and what has been a very competitive game should be an exciting finish. Here's Westbrook. He'll bring it up for Miami. They've held a 12-point lead early. And for Miami, look at who they've got out there. They've got Russell Westbrook. Moses Malone out there with Drexel. Then it's Joel Embiid. And it's Jordan in at the two. And one of the league's most effective shot blockers from that guard position. Jordan can do it and help defense four on the ball. Weber, he's checked in for Moses Malone. And we just got a second look there at the exceptional mobile one block. And boy, did he get up quick to reject that shot. That's as fundamental as defense gets. On defense, Miami. Six-point lead. Count the basket. Tatum's got the fourth quarter going with the first basket of the period here for Boston. And that's right in his wheelhouse. Looking to make an impact when it counts. It's the fourth quarter, and it's a close game. You want to get the ball to someone you can rely on. They've been struggling here on offense. Yeah, a bit of a dry spell for sure. 
Here's Tatum. Over Drexler. And he overshot that one, missing. What I like, he hasn't stopped competing despite the off night. And he uses the glass Boy, on the way. Drexler. And now it's a nine-point Miami lead. A one-man show offensively, and that's almost always good news for his team. We're just over a minute into this final quarter of play. And the foul called on Russell Westbrook. Foul. That'll be his Russell second foul of the game. Westbrook. That's his second personal foul. First team foul. Now here's Kidd. And here's Corbett from the arm. Good, and it's Tatum picking up the assist. You can't allow that defense. Kyle Corbett is lights out on the catch and shoot. Miami leading by six. Outside Westbrook. Fires from deep. That one, no good. And the Celtics going the other way now. Here's Kemp. Tries again. And he drops in the way up off the glass. Vital basket there. This is just the time and really just the situation when he looks to take over. Near the three-point line, it's Westbrook. Perfect on the shot. Swishes it through. And Miami leads by six. The quick thinking of Westbrook, sensing separation and electing to go right up. And good that time. Now that's a big play. The veteran Kyle Korver still getting buckets. Westbrook kicks to Jordan. Gets it to go from beyond the arc. Defensively, you have to tight up on him or suffer the consequences. Got a piece of it. Stolen by Drexler. In transition, here comes Miami. Weber, the pass to Jordan. Now Drexler. Outside Jordan. Fires the three. And again, Miami with the triple. And a moment here to take a look at some of the hustle stats for Miami. They've been playing such pesky oh, defense. Oh, it's been very oh, impressive, Drexler. especially all the turnovers they've caused. And ball. I also love second what they've done defensively ball. in terms of closing out to the, the shooters, getting the hand up, Three. just making them feel a little uncomfortable on the offensive end. Abdul Jabbar has checked in for Miami. Tatum gets to Kemp, fires for three. That's it, and the Miami lead is cut to just seven points in the basket from Corbin. He has really made an impact from beyond today. That's another triple. Just think where they'd be without all the work he's done from the three-point line today. And we've got an update here, so let's catch up with David Aldridge. During that last break, Kevin, I got a chance to hear what Quinn Snyder said to his team. He said, I want us to play as though we're behind. We're good when we play with urgency. We're bad when we become complacent. Don't become complacent. Let's go. Guys? Thanks, David. Drexler passes to Abdul Jabbar. Miami needs to get a shot off. Drexler's shot is off. Not quite enough defense. That time around, just lucky. She was off. Personal foul. Third team foul. Boston trails by seven. Kid passes to Tatum. He lobs up the alley and pass. And Tatum is all about doing what's best for the team. Superb as a ball mover in terms of finding his teammate. Westbrook against Kidd. Here's Weber. Nailed from three-point land. Three. And Miami leads by eight. How can you leave this guy that wide open? Please. That's terrible. Drexler gets Tatum. Outside for Corbin. And the Celtics hit again from deep. And the crowd is loving this long-range bomb attack that we're seeing here tonight coming right back to answer a three with one of their own. With the step back. Weber, the pass to West. From outside the arc. Second chance shot. Back to Drexler. Three-pointer, rebounded by Corvo. And here's Boston, trailing by five. A three-pointer off the mark. And now we've got the intentional foul. Embiid, he's checked in for Miami. That's his first personal foul. 
first team foul. There's 31 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Here's Jordan, and there's the drive. And he's fouled pretty hard on that shot, but he's got the chance to pick up the points at the line. And slashing there by Jordan. Gets up to speed in a hurry. Just impossible to stay in front of. So he goes two for two at the line. And it's a seven-point game. Adding a little cushion to their advantage. Nice work at the line. Corver from the arc, and it's Miami with the rebound. They've held a 12-point lead early. Watch for Clark. Drexler against Tatum. Drexler kicks to MB. Drexler left side in the corner. It's Westbrook from the arc. Not gonna go that time. And so it's Miami winning this one. A narrow win under difficult circumstances, Greg, as the visiting team. It really was, but that didn't seem to bother me. I mean, both teams, sure you home get home team, all I know we'll see is they were the better team. Well said. And that'll wrap it up, folks. Now for Greg Anthony, Steve Smith, and David Aldridge. This is Kevin Harlan. Thanks for watching the NBA here on 2K Sports. We'll see you next time.